Ohio voters pass amendment protecting access to abortion. Ohio voters approved a constitutional amendment on Tuesday that ensures access to abortion and other forms of reproductive health care, the latest victory for abortion rights supporters since the U.S. Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade last year. Ohio became the seventh state where voters decided to protect abortion access after the landmark ruling and was the only state to consider a statewide abortion rights question this year. The future is bright and tonight we can celebrate this win for bodily autonomy and reproductive rights, Lauren Blauvelt, co-chair of Ohioans United for Reproductive Rights, which led support for the amendment, told a jubilant crowd of supporters. the outcome of the intense off-year election could be a bellwether for 2024 when Democrats hope the issue will energize their voters and help President Joe Biden keep the White House. Voters in Arizona, Missouri, and elsewhere are expected to vote on similar protections next year. Ohio's resounding support for this constitutional amendment reaffirms Democratic priorities, and sends a strong message to the state GOP that reproductive rights are non-negotiable, she said in a statement. President Joe Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris issued statements celebrating the amendment's win, emphasizing that attempts to ban or severely restrict abortion represent a minority view across the country. Ohio's constitutional amendment, on the ballot as Issue 1, included some of the most protective language for abortion access of any statewide ballot initiative since the Supreme Court's ruling. Opponents had argued that the amendment would threaten parental rights, allow unrestricted gender surgeries for minors, and revive partial birth abortions, which are federally banned. Public polling shows about two-thirds of Americans say abortion should generally be legal in the earliest stages of pregnancy, a sentiment that has been underscored in both Democratic and deeply Republican states since the justices overturned Roe in June 2022. Voter turnout for Ohio's amendment, including early voting, was robust for an off-year election. Issue 1's approval will all but certainly undo a 2019 state law passed by Republicans that bans most abortions after fetal cardiac activity is detected, with no exceptions for rape and incest. That law, currently on hold because of court challenges, is one of roughly two dozen restrictions on abortion the Ohio legislature has passed in recent years. Republicans remained defiant in the wake of Tuesday's vote. Ohio House Speaker Jason Stevens said Issue 1's approval is not the end of the conversation. Previously, State Senate President Matt Huffman, a Republican, has suggested that lawmakers could come back with another proposed amendment next year that would undo Issue 1, although they would have only a six-week window after Election Day to get it on the 2024 primary ballot. Issue 1 specifically declared an individual's right to make and carry out one's own reproductive decisions, including birth control, fertility treatments, miscarriage, and abortion. It allowed the state to regulate the procedure after fetal viability as long as exceptions were provided for cases in which a doctor determined the life or health of the woman was at risk. Viability was defined as the point when the fetus had a significant likelihood of survival outside the womb with reasonable interventions. The latest vote followed an August special election called by the Republican-controlled legislature that was aimed at making future constitutional changes harder to pass by increasing the threshold from a simple majority vote to 60%.
Voters overwhelmingly defeated that special election question, setting the stage for the high-stakes fall abortion campaign, 